so unbelievably close to taking a monkey. Just flew by that, this, this branch right here, and they were all in that maripa there. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes. That was insane. Yeah. Oh my gosh. The wingspan, what would you say the wingspan was? Oh my. Everyone's getting down out of the trees. We just found these bones. They definitely look like mammal bones. There's a skull right there. And other pieces are laying around it. Guanini. Harpy eagle. Harpy eagle. As you can see, the black, the band. The black neck band, the white chest, and the Jews have don't have the black band. Okay, and apparently, whatever the harpy had, she dropped it, and we found it. And there you see Stephen with the remains of a howler. And it's not pretty. Looks like it might have something in its talons. Can you see anything on the tree below it? I can't. Looks like it's not to see a branch. This is more footage of the uh, adult harpy eagle crying to the juvenile. The adult has something in its hands, in its talons rather. Perhaps part of a monkey. Very red and bloody. It's on the branch. at the harpy nest. Uh, she's actually there, although you can't see it from, from the footage. We saw her fly in right after we got here. Right here, that seemed to be, we're on the east side of the tree. And I believe this is where the... Shot of the Juve again today on the 31st. He 
flew over here, so he's hot older, which, which means that we haven't seen him in a long time. His headdress is not developed, he's all puffy on the head, but he's got a light gray band and he can fly. Fourteenth, we're at the Harpy Nest, and got the remains of what appears to be a two-toed sloth. Can't be more than a week old. It's still got quite a bit of flesh on it. 